The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Allen. She's a superstar who first earned some attention for amazing resilience during her battles on the independent circuit. She was at a crossroads in her career, but that all changed when she met Shawn Michaels and Beth Phoenix at the WWE Performance Center. The irresistible force is on Raw. And from San Diego, California, Nia Jax. Hey, whenever Nia Jax enters an arena, whenever Nia Jax enters a match, everyone takes notice of the dominance that this woman is capable of. She's beautiful, she's powerful, she's dangerous. It's like a million dollar smile on a wrecking ball. Nia Jax is the irresistible force to be reckoned with. That is a woman who looks like she owns the ring. Been so impressed with what this young lady has accomplished in such a short time. Her eyes will lure you in, but her style will destroy you. That is Nia Jax to a T. And coming into this matchup, there has been a fire burrowing inside of this superstar. Well, she certainly has the look of someone that's tired of being taken lightly, angry at the disrespect she's been shown. She'll be looking to take out all that anger throughout the course of this match. Nia Jax has made a career here in WWE out of laying waste to her opponents, out of absolutely dominating them in the center of the ring with her size and her power. The irresistible force is a pillar of ungodly strength in this division, and don't you forget it. That certainly wasn't pretty. Short jab. It's raining down those shots to the back of the neck. Clubbing blows. And now she's climbing to the top turn by Lion. Exposed with that maneuver. Nia's getting picked apart here, though I don't see Nia struggling much longer. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. Showing her competition what a real superstar looks like. Down across the neck. Makes the cover. One, two. And she stops the count. She just might have more malicious intentions in mind. Back suplex. Oh, no. Face buster. Big four. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Snapping the leg and oh, the torque on the knee. And she dodges that one nicely. The knee right. Sent into the corner. She adjusts it and reverses it. Oh, smashing the 
Hands off. Headbutt to the back of the neck. What a chancery. Stretched out like Taffy right now. I'm not sure there's anything she can do here. She is trapped and in danger. Byron, she can do this just like you've done your whole career. Tap. How in the world is she going to get out of this? Trying to slide somehow down the back and does. Could be all the right here. Oh, just turn the lights out. Two, two. Wow, just barely making it out. Are we sure that wasn't three? Uh, just about as close as you can get. And Nia Jax is astonished that she didn't close it out with that one. Put their opponent away. Gory special submission is in, but not done just yet. Ooh, face first. Man just vanquished the irresistible force. There's two. Three. 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 Here is your winner, Allen. She did what she needed to do and came away with a strong victory. This certainly wasn't an easy win, but she pulled it off. And in the end, that's all that matters. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Allen. This superstar credits her time on the Indies as a major factor in her success in WWE. Indie experience aside, it didn't hurt to have Booker T, Shawn Michaels, and Beth Phoenix's help along the way. She's ready to unleash the fury. Nia Jax's opponent may be coming into tonight's rematch with momentum after a big win, but Nia is fighting with some extra fuel of her own. She's fighting for her family. Nia is also fighting to make sure The Rock doesn't bury her on social media again. Ouch. There is no doubt Nia's got the weight of the world on her, but both superstars are definitely competing under some extra pressure, knowing The Rock is watching. Jax. 
Incoming! Cena sent on from the top rope! Uh. Uh. Oh, look at the impact here! Just Boom! Boom! Pummeling the chest of their opponent. This is brutal! My goodness! Nia Jax just getting worked on here. Nia needs to find that irresistible force once more. No way! Oh, God! A totally ill-advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. Look at this! High risk! It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. in under the ropes. And now she's climbing to the top turn. That's insane! She's just getting worked over right now. Yeah, she's being met with a roadblock every time. Watch her set up in the corner. Is Nia going for it? She is. One of her cousin's signature moves, the rock bottom. This has to be the end of this match. Apparently, Nia's not done yet. What is she trying to prove here? She just put her hands on the referee. That's an automatic disqualification. I don't think her mindset's on winning the match anymore. Nia Jax is clearly trying to prove a point. And with that rock bottom, it seems very clear who she's trying to prove herself to. How much more punishment can her opponent take? All for Nia Jax's delicate ego? She's... Hey, no, not... No, don't do it, Nia. Come on! Samoa dropped to the floor. Guys, she might be badly injured. Well, one thing's for certain, that message Nia Jax sent tonight was heard loud and clear and won't be forgotten anytime soon.
Glad to see you up and around. We've been worried about you. Up and around, but still sore and bruised. I gotta be real. Naya did a number on me. This sounds cliche, especially coming from me. But it looks like maybe you've lost your smile. Happens to the best of us. There's no getting around it. It was a vicious attack. That kind of thing can take a toll, both physically and mentally. Well, like I said, I still have a long way to go before I'm fully clear. And it seems like when I am, Naya's not going to back down. I think you're right about Naya. You're going to have to be ready to face her again, and that's going to take a lot of work. So looks like you have a big decision ahead of you. I know what it's like firsthand to have to recover and train to get back in the game. And I watched Edge go through it too. And I also know what it's like to walk away, so I totally respect that choice too. Sometimes it's best to step back for a bit before coming back stronger than ever. So with all that being said, how are you feeling? Do you want to train to face Nye again? Or take a step back and walk away from the fight for a bit? I'm not here to back down from a fight. I'm here to show the world and the WWE Universe what I'm made of. I know it's going to be a hard road back, but let's do this. Let's train. I'm ready. I would have supported you no matter what, but I'm proud that you chose to take on Naya. Same here. Honestly, it was the only choice I could have made. It's going to be tough, but that's who I am. The good news is, you won't be doing this alone. I'm going to be with you every step of the way. All right, no more talk. Let's get you back in the ring. I'll be your first opponent. Try to beat me before the time limit expires.
So, I know I'm cleared, but do you really think I'm ready? Yes. You know I never doubted you. But after watching you train over these last few weeks, I'm prouder than ever of the superstar you've become and the person you've always been. Oh, Beth. You're gonna make me feel an emotion. Save that feeling, and instead make Naya feel your presence in the ring. Being a hard-working superstar doesn't put you above having the right to a little revenge. You deserve it. Another dominating win for Nia Jax, who's been on quite the tear recently here on Raw. Hold on, is that who I think it is? And she's back. She's taking it to Nia Jax. But Nia's giving it right back to her. Nia charges, and she goes head first over the ropes. Nia took her out with that vicious Samoan drop to the outside, and she's been out injured ever since. Finally, this is her chance for revenge. She's got a table. With the table, ram it into Nia's face. That's one way to get payback. I don't think she's finished. It looks like she's going to attempt to put Nia through the table. I know she's out for revenge, but she has to be smart. She could end up re-injuring herself in the process. After what Nia did to her, I don't think she cares. Up to the apron, the same apron that Nia Jax slammed her off of, putting her on the shelf. And down with a splash through the table. Unbelievable. It looks like that took a toll on her, too. Yeah, but she's the one standing tall, and Nia isn't. The following contest is a tables match. Making her way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Allen. This superstar survived training with Booker T and battled through the Indies before she got the call to report to Orlando. And she leveled up the train alongside icon Shawn Michaels and Beth Phoenix at the Performance Center. And now we're going to see the results of the training. It's been a long road back to the bright lights of WWE for Nia Jax's opponent. But tonight, she's finally clawed her way back. 
and it doesn't get any bigger than a tables match. It's a testament to Nia's opponent's courage. Courage? This is insanity, Saxton. Nia already pulverized her opponent once, and I hope there's another medical facility nearby just in case it happens again. Whatever happens, we know some of the biggest names in WWE history will be watching. From Beth Phoenix to the people's champion himself, The Rock. Taking flight! Good Lord! Taking flight! It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. WWE Universe wants tables. Well, they've got tables. So take things into the ring. <laughs> Set out of the ring, not sure she wants to be here. means she has the whole outside to play with. And back in the ring we go. She re-enters the ring now. Uh -oh. the press. She's getting that table right where she wants it. She clearly has something in mind. Byron, she has no idea where she is right now. And I assure you, the top of that turnbuckle is not where you want to be when you're in this kind of condition. Nia's getting picked apart here. Though, I don't see Nia struggling much longer. And returning to the rank. This might swing the match in her favor. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat.